All right. Wooly was just telling me how good he is at playing Virgil in this game and how he is the biggest expert that ever was and that he is going to crush this with all S ranks. Isn't that right, Wolves? I appreciate <laughs> the construction of the bus. Yeah. The parking of the bus outside yeah. of my house. Yeah, that's right. The moving of my bed. Yeah. Under the bus and me waking up to find, hey, There's what? There's a bus here. Oh. Wow. Oh. Actually, I do. I, I, uh, the other day, when we recorded the last couple episodes of this, you mentioned a bunch of Virgil shit I, I don't fucking remember. Back in the day, uh, he uh, when this came out, I was really like, okay, what are we going to do? Are you going to give me my Virgil? Are you going to give me my Virgil? I remember him being more fun to play than Dante, but his enemies are uh, worse. They get... they Yeah, so we'll, we'll, we'll get through those, I suppose, but... Um, he clearly remembered it way better than I fucking did. Yeah, because he had he had he had those embeds. He had those embeds. Uh, I guess we'll do tutorials. Yeah, why not? All tutorials. Oh yeah, all of them. Oh, no, only no, only the Virgil ones. That way it'll be. Although fun. I haven't. Oh, anyway. The, the you know what's weird about this game? Right when we loaded it up, I said, but I mean, we were recording then. It's like the Dirt, Virgil's downfall is treated like a completely different game in the, the game's fucking. Yeah, it doesn't even use the same save file. And it doesn't even use the same animation stuff for the cutscenes. <laughs> Probably for budgetary constraints. Yeah, then no, they did. This is cheaper. So what is happening? He he. This is like ten seconds after the end of the uh, the end of the game. When he walks through the portal. Yeah, and he's like, oh. Yeah, he was he was acting all tough when he walked away. Yeah, but he and was actually he, very hurt. What happened to us, father? Oh, subtitles. Damn it. Dante betrayed me. There's nothing left for me here. Oh no. He's downfalling. Look at him go. The night is calling. Was that real? Did that actually occur? This is a fucking motion comic. Yeah. Virgil. Virgil. Look, his hair's a little mussed up. It's almost like he should tuck it back at some point. I agree. No, he doesn't. He literally never I know, does. he just kind of looks messy. And I really was like, oh, that's a. they're going to do that because he's going to tuck it back later, right? Oh, you got to turn those subtitles on so bad. And then, we're going to talk and, over this shit. And when they never did... You were, you were. It was like you're are you, the one thing that Virgil does where he tucks his hair. You didn't do it. No, but just uses cool lines as achievements. All right, what do you have? Those look familiar. Those look much more familiar than Dante's basic moveset, actually. And he's only always oh, got the angel thing. There we go. I gotta say, this DLC gave me a really bad feeling right from the start. Did it? Yeah, because it was the motion comic, mm. and then it dropped us into this asset reuse portal hellscape mm. platform, and I was like, oh. So, uh... My amulet, it's gone. Oh no. Yeah, so he's got he's got his Yamato. Look at it, it's so pretty. It means Japanese sword. And uh, the summon swords are all still there. And work as you would expect. But you can do uh, summon swords where I I go to you yeah. like that. Or you can do the uh, I bring you to me. Yeah, just like Dante, but it looks way better. <laughs> type thing. And that's how that go. Square two shoot. You can do it, man. And he's got the Dark Slayer style pretty much, right? Like, there's no style yeah. meter in yeah. here. Yeah. Like, it, it's it's when you bring out their... I mean, it's when you bring out the, um, the other modes, whatever, uh, Angel Demon mode. Yeah. It's like different Yamato versions. Uh, without any direction... L1 performs trick up. And then, yeah, you can use it to really exploit shit. Yeah. 
Oh man, this game is so bizarre. I got contacted recently by uh, a friend of mine who was like, thank you for playing this. I always heard about it, but I never felt the need to actually <sighs> to, oh, to play go it myself. Luck. Yeah, yeah. And it's like, that is the Give worst thing you could ever say about a game. My, I, my like, eyeballs never cared to settle looking at the thing in front of them. I did, like, he didn't even bother to watch an LP until it came up on a channel he already regularly watched. Fucking whoops. Dante talking mad shit. Oh, man. And, uh... God, Virgil's such a fucking stupid cunt in this game. Like, oh! There was a change that we missed! In, in the DE. One other, one last edit mm -hmm. that we missed. In the cutscene. So he moves the platforms towards him like that. He teleports him, even. In the cutscene, uh, where they're doing the hostage ne negotiation. Yeah. Dante has his gun resting on his lap in the cutscene that we saw. In the original version, he had it jammed into her stomach. And it was like, mmm. Mm, I'll shoot this baby. Right, right. He was threatening it anyway. Yeah. yeah okay. Well, Dante was. Right. But it was only a threat. So if, uh... There's one weird thing. Virgil's downfall. He's walking around. He doesn't have his strongest weapon ever. The fucking sniper rifle. No. <laughs> uh, Can and we... Somebody wanted me to talk about this, and I'm sure you want to talk about it as well. Can we talk about how fucking big the hole in Lilith was? And it's like a basketball. And think about how think about how Dante had to shoot and kill and fight that boss fight, and then that one gun. You know does why? that? It's the strongest weapon in the entire universe. It's because it was a cutscene gun. It was a cutscene gun. The strongest gun of all. Plot plot guns. Plot, right. plot bullets. Haha! -ha, you cut some birds that aren't there. Except, oh no! Look, a it's cool a new enemy. I don't remember if these were the problem enemy or not. No, they're not. They're not. I remember there's one enemy in his, in like, the last parts of his levels that are just like... The worst. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I don't remember what they look like or why they're like that. Uh, it's because of the bullshit they throw out at you. Oh, man. They, they just, they're un, they're unfun fucking... They're fu funless meter. Uh, funless enemies. Funless, yeah. Funless enemies. They're now, just... Wolves, you actually, you just streamed, uh, fucking DMC4 Virgil. Yes. The, like, three days ago? And got all the way to the end, right? Uh, basically. And now Virgil there was added after this game came out. Yes. How would you feel about the two different Virgils? Not the same fucking beast at all. And, um, just, you're, it's like, it's, it's just, I, I don't know how, to, it's like you're just so much more limited in every possible way. Um, but I will say that you do get other things that, that you have other free- he does have other freedoms that you get later on. Um, there are things about this Virgil that you will see when you upgrade them Somewhat you are need. interesting, yeah. yes. And, uh, not- he's, it's not completely without merit, you know? But... There's a thing here. Base tool set, though, is, uh, pretty bare bones. Yeah, I kind of shocked they didn't, like... Because in DMC 4, Virgil is, like, overwhelming to control when you pick him up the first time. Because, like, here's three weapons. Okay. Right, right away. Yeah. Right? So you can get your enemy step right and off the bat. And that's it for gener general purpose Otherwise, he's got, he's got trick all over the place and such. Mm -hmm. uh, Slasher. You can power up that. Cross cut. It's the second combo yeah, sequence. It's the, the, yeah, the mm -hmm. judgment cut. You need it. Right. It's important. Uh, and then perfect slice. You see that third version oh, of it? Oh, I see it. That's the that's the timing based ones. Uh, aerial wave. And so you start with his basic moves, all of them except for judgment cut. Uh, but but no, but but yes, yeah, yeah. Uh, as default. And then, but you're not seeing some stuff like rapid slash or like the, uh, you know, uh, starfall and so on. Mm. And, and that's based on the. Well, yeah, because he doesn't have fists, so does he? Get, uh, well, they, they do another thing with that instead. Do they? So, yeah, we'll I, go with... I fucking can't remember at all. We'll go with the Judgment Cut. Yeah, new moves. Um, 
and can I select it? No, I can't. But you see the the embeds there yeah. are the ones that like they leave the blade inside and then they let you mm. uh, teleport or whatever. So you leave it in. Yeah, just leave it in. Really important to leave it in. God, that fuck. Go up to abilities. Let's get a no, no. Just, just oh yeah. Have you seen his other skins though? Oh no, actually, <laughs> he looks terrible. Oh. He looks like he put on a shit ton of eyeshadow as he fell down. Let's see if I can. I, 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 no, not, we're not mid mission. Yeah, so. not in here, unfortunately. Okay, but I can't. Can I buy a home? No, nah, I can't. you don't got shit. All right, well, you can eventually get some health orbs. So, judgment cut. And he uses the, the 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 fucking judgment cut like look from four. What's the timing? It's just like right on that. You might not have it. No, I don't have it. I definitely yeah. don't have it. But I, I think it's like right as it flickers. You're you're dead. What? You're trapped here, just like me. But you can escape. You still have so a chance. So that wound did kill him. Oh, cool. The light. Find but his the light status as big here. Nephilim boss boy. Means he allows gets him to life. just not die. I don't okay. think anybody's ever like cheated death more overtly and more bullshit than Kratos. Come to think of it, yeah, because he, he straight up just fucking dies multiple times and then just leaves. Like that, Virgil got teleported. It means very here, little. It means very little. And it's to die. It's like up to the viewer, I suppose, to determine whether or not this is all in his mind or mm -hmm, not. Mm -hmm. Which I think is lame, but but Kratos just leaves. He just goes no. He goes to visit his daughter, then he just walks away. Yeah. She's like she was hanging out right over there the whole time. Yeah, and she was like, "Daddy, why'd you stab me?" The cause you of his pain and suffering. Fuck? No, Ares is the cause of his pain and suffering, Willie. How silly of you <laughs> to get that. <laughs> that could be. Oh. Oh, even after the good-ass new God of War, I still love making fun of Kratos. Oh, it's fun. Oh, it feels good in my chest. Can I get up there for me? How Probably the fuck not. do you get up? Oh, no, you jump back. Or... Oh, yeah, there you go. One thing this game did massively improve, I'll give it a little golf clap. I'm sure we said it earlier. But all of the platforming sections in DMC4 are just woeful <laughs> by comparison. I mean, one thing is clear is the ability to just fucking zip around and do what you need to. Yeah. On I mean, on the enemies that that phase in is still there. Yeah. So that that feels correct. I'm just thinking of like get this blue orb by using snatch to slingshot yourself. Whereas in this game, it's like, you, you hit the button and you are there. There's actually no momentum to it at all. It is a blink, it's not a slingshot. I really like the change, and I think, did they carry that board in 4? Uh, which, which Where it's like, you're using the summon swords to teleport yourself to the summon swords. Yeah, yeah, that's what they did. So 4 brings in the, uh, the trick, the trick swords, basically. Because... Uh, um, My main issue with, like, uh, his constant teleporting in 3 was that I kind of had trouble visually distinguishing where I was going to end up. Mm -hmm. Which is dumb, because I was locked on, but the sword helps me kind of plan it. It's also less instantaneous, which I guess is worse, but it makes it easier for me to follow. Yeah, no, the the uh, it, it, they did add it to him, and it's one of my fun, one of, the, one of the coolest things to me. Oh my god! Is the fact that he fucking gets to do that. Look, we're crumbling these pre-built assets. Oh! Big whiffers. Uh, yeah, if you um, like, if you go back to Virgil in three, it's actually surprising like how little he can do uh, by comparison. So, well, his four version is just. It's like, it feels like half the dev time of the SC. Got just went to into give that. Virgil more moves. You know what? I couldn't see those points on the blue background. They were... They I were literally could not see them at all. The gates of paradise are closed. No. So, ironically, in this game, it is Virgil who is the mother. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, I guess it's supposed to be, well, Virgil's more angel-like and Dante's more devil-like. Though it was pointed out 
that even though Dante is not going murder as we are used to, what was the first thing he did in this game? Mm. What was it? Bang some angels. Oh yes, that's true, that's true. Just like mother. Yeah, yeah, you're not wrong. And he didn't even know it. You know? Oh god. He didn't even know that that was his mom. Think about it. Oh god, that's so much worse. Oh look, it's two it's of my mom. <laughs> <laughs> like it's like there's the metaphor like he's chasing after it now like he just needs it. I need to go back. <sighs> I'm looking up something. Okay. So that's what his I'm looking up. That's what his mom looked like. Okay. So I think it would have been extra hilarious if the strippers looked like his mom, but I don't think they do. I think they in fact they even have faces. They had faces. Are you sure? And one of them says, Fuck you, Dante, later yeah, in the story. Right. Yeah, you can totally go flying off the stage too at times. Yeah, I'm watching that. It's kind of silly. The, the Birdmans, they will gladly float off the platform. And then you're fucked if there's no enemy back where you need to actually go. God, did they fucking add lock on for Virgil in the original version? Uh, the original version? Version. Like, did he not? No, he he had it. I mean, he had it right. Because the original I, Dante did not have lock on. You know what? Then I don't know. I feel like they, they did though. I don't remember. I don't remember. It's so confusing. This game shipped with no goddamn lock on. Oh fuck! That looks bad. Virgil. You're in danger. Cat. Hey, Virgil. Yeah, that's not what happened. Not going anywhere. That's what it felt like it happened. Feel, brother, you me. backstabbed me. Because I didn't talk. But we did talk, actually. You just really didn't like what I had to say. And then Virgil went to his sword first. And faced him face ooh, to face. Ooh, sound effects. Ooh. Oh, they're just not there, huh? Oh, dear. Well, that's unfortunate. Mmm. Yowzers. I was hoping that was going to spell dad for a minute. Oh. Uh. <laughs> sounds are gone. Oh, yeah. Sounds be gone. Well, let's take a look at the skins, shall we? Oh, yeah. Hey, hey, hand me the hand me the mouse for a sec. Mm-hmm. I want to see something. Yeah, sounds are gone. Sounds are just gone. Sounds are super the gone. The game is just not giving us sound anymore. Fucking it's not sick. a recording. It's we just, can put we can be classic. That looks so bad. <laughs> is that all you have, those two? Uh I think so. Yeah, that's it. That is so awful. Gonna, that looks like look Andrew at Garfield at a fucking Halloween party. We're gonna do it. Smelling his own ass. Alright, give me a health cross. And I will take... Like, I understand they're like, hey, we want it to... Level 2 summon sword. We want it to feel like the old or, game, right? Or, you know, oh, the nostalgia thing. But oftentimes when the games are different... Mm -hmm. The art style of the old costume is just like, huh, right? I think the only DMC game that I can think of that the, the, the character's old costume looks good is DMC 3, Dante's DMC 1 outfit. I think it looks oh, really good. Oh, yeah, the, the, the But retro, like in DMC yeah. 4, if you go like LDK, it's like, mm, mm, -mm. Yeah, mm -mm. I, though I've never really felt super great about those. Yeah. Let's see if the sound comes back. There it is. It did! That's <laughs> awful! Huge big bug boys. Big old buggos. Oh yeah, it came back in the recording too. Everybody at home hears it. Look at you. Who are you? You failed. Your father gave you everything. And now you have nothing. Yeah, neither of those things are true. Everyone you care about, everyone you love, has turned their back on you. Not accurate. How does it feel? <laughs> you didn't explain what you wanted to do, so they just went, what? Also, uh, Virgil has regular human parents that were just 
nice and rich and took care of him and that's how he stayed off the grid yeah so you can just you take it to mean Virgil's been like stupid inside the whole time he's having flashbacks to his own idiot his own stupid shit yeah Ooh, it was Cat's fault. That was nicely animated. Yeah, yeah, it was. It's weird though. Why that one shot gets so much extra frames? Look, Cat? as opposed to that no, pan. Yeah. That. Virgil, it's that. That please. piece of shit. The. Oh <laughs> my god! Oh my god! It's so bad. Let's go, Daddy V. Oh, Angel no. mode. So this is where you get rapid slash. You get your you, yeah. Flare yeah. orbit aerial flush. Oh, oh, let's god. see. Oh it. no, my shit's my shit's. Oh swirling. my god. Virgil must have rapid slashed my mic. Your mic stand. Why would you? It's, do oh, it wants to touch your mouth. It's Why fine. is it doing that? Really hard to move away from me. I think it wants to leave. <laughs> it. it Okay, here we Our go. Our equipment is physically leaving the area. Here we go. All right. Great. You know what's a bummer about this DLC? Mm -hmm. It's a massive sequel hook. Yeah, it's, it is. It's like a two and a half hour long fucking stinger slash teaser for next time on. It's totally that. And I think we talked about it in the main game, but I, I finished this game going, yeah, no, that's not getting a fucking sequel. There's no fucking way. A hundred percent what they were going for. So, like, I got to the end of this DLC, <laughs> Look and, at it, this Virgil. and it's like, oh, what'll Virgil do? I'm like, nothing. The story's going nowhere. You know what would be fucking wild? Mm -hmm. You know how Virgil's back in five? What if he's like, I'm finally back from my downfall? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Oh man, I would love it. I think that spin move might be the ugliest move Virgil has ever had. Uh, what's the other one? That? No, no, no. Where is it? That one. What is that? It's uh, the it's like an air projectile. Yeah, it's weird? a it's a weird one. It's a it's a very weird one. Like that spin right there, where he spins horizontally. Yeah. It's not very graceful looking. Did I do that? Nah. Oh man. I can feel. I wonder the if Suno the slushy sounds of each hit. I wonder if Itsuno san was working with them on this, the way he helped them with the base game. Because Virgil's moves are copied more directly in some in a lot of cases. Also, look at the cut of his coat. It's the same oh, like yeah. of, as the other cut. Just it's not it's not the actual. It old looks coat. more similar from the back. Like his moves are copied more wholesale, but I feel like they lose they lose more in their translation. Like uh, what's it called? Rapid slash where he dashes forward. Yep. That's his stinger. Yep. Like this version's terrible because the slash is all on the trip. There's nothing behind him when he does it. It's like, no, it's supposed to be that it's so fast that it, it cuts behind, you know, like a samurai. So I'm way off the fucking stage Yeah, now. I see that. And that's that's how these things kind of go, yeah. Maybe the upgraded version will be better. Oh, great, you'll just take, like, a hit if you fall off, right? Lock onto someone else? No! no. Yeah, yeah, you just take one hit. So they give you a character with even more aerial control than Dante, and give you just the tiniest platforms ever. Like, this thing is half the width of a DMC4, um, Bloody Palace platform. Yeah, essentially. Like, it's it's, re it's like a thinner it's very thing thin. to, f and the whole doll and the whole downfall is like that. 
Like, there's only a couple rooms that are, like, really wide open. Uh, but almost none of them have walls. And you're kind of just, like, you're, you're more open to fall, even though you have way more aerial control. Um, In fact, the fact that you have more aerial control usually allows you to fall. Okay, so... Oh, you've... Uh, yeah. Angel, angel mode. Angel mode. And give myself... Wooly has become the absolute master at destroying microphone stands. There is no one in this world I would trust more to damage a microphone stand. We can give ourselves Rising Star. Hold circle and do that. Or we can go more Summon Swords. Is that just a damage or is it they shoot faster? Well, this is a this is a new move. No, no, I mean the, the Summon Swords. Uh, yeah, greater frequency. You yeah, shoot okay. more. That's my, that's my preferred. Yeah, better guns. Right? No, I don't mean the, the guns. I mean, like... I, I would prefer to shoot more swords oh. than for the swords to do more damage. Right. Okay. I think it just looks a lot fancier. Is it? Like, this is a fantastical environment, right? Mm -hmm. And I look at it, and my eyes just kind of glaze over, and I'm completely bored by it. Oh, you see that because up there? Yeah, I do. Because it's just... Like, the color palette's really limited, right? Like, it's just red and blue. The whole way through. I just look at this fucking... <laughs> oh, man. He looks... He looks the way we feel. <laughs> what were they thinking? Oh, shit. That's great. Andrew Garfield Virgil is here. Oh, I hear one. Oh, there it is. I forgot that those gave a sound cue. I got through the whole game. And didn't realize it had a sound cue until you just mentioned it just now. Yeah, they always go, Ooh. Remember, getting those is just as important as your style. I wonder if you're gonna fight anyone here. Let me run around while I have it charged. No, bitch. Then that's it, it's cancelled. Oh. oh. Yay! Yeah. Knows they're reintroducing enemies to you. Yeah, yeah, you're gonna fight some of the same old ones too that you that we we've seen. No, but I mean like they're going in the same progression. Like they're they're positioning this almost as if you hadn't played the base game at all. And in fact, remember when we did <coughs> those tutorial messages? Mm -hmm. That was one of the possible options. It's like if you're playing Virgil's Downfall first, you'll need all the tutorial messages. 